Hello everyone, welcome to Tekken 2, this is Michael Smith. Today we're going to look at how to do a crown under an existing partial. Uh, there are a few different ways, uh, today I'm going to show you one. Uh, when you have the partial, what you can do, uh, you'll scan in your uh, master model as your margins marked. Uh, then you're going to scan in the partial under the gingival mask. Uh, place your partial on the original model. Uh, scan it into the gingival mask. Uh, make sure that you get good uh, clasp adaptation. You want to make sure you get the internal part of the clasp really good. Uh, you don't want to have anything, uh, any voids or anything there because it might, you're basically going to use this for a visual is what you're going to use it for. So once you have that, we're going to move on. You're going to propose a tooth once you propose a tooth, you simply turn on your lower gingiva, make it transparent, and then you can come in here and make any and every adjustment that you need. So you can see this white area is actually engaging into the clasp. The pink area is not. Uh, for a few uh, tips here you do want to have a little bit not much just a little bit of engagement of the clasp and that way once you mill this um, you seat it to the model the partial will slip right on the clasp will actually engage now keep on keep an understanding that if you're going to uh, uh, simply just polish this uh, you may want to uh, pull a little bit more of the crown out to engage the clasp, but for us, we are going to stain and glaze this crown. So since we're going to stain and glaze it per the doctor's request, uh, with this engagement divot here, uh, which they requested as well, um, we're just going to leave it into uh, into the the visual a little bit. Thank you for your time today. Uh, please stay tuned for many more videos to come.